Hi, this is Jeffrey Douglas. In this episode, we're going to be looking at the new Helinox Sunset Chair. It's a super great chair. It's very light and super comfortable. So the chair is uh, really lightweight. It's real easy to set up. You can throw it in a backpack and take it with you and set it up to have some lunch or something. So I'm really excited to have it. And let's take a quick look at how it sets up. So it comes in a really nice package here. Uh, it's got loops on, on both sides of the package. Like I said, I can fit it into uh, my day pack really easily. And I'll put the specifications in the video for you, but um, it's something that's small enough that you wouldn't hesitate to actually put it in your pack and carry it with you. So some of the reasons we uh, bought these chairs are for beach use. Uh, obviously we do a lot of camping and stuff, so they'll be a nice camp chair. Uh, they're good if you want to go out on a hike and take them with you. Not sure I would use them too much for backpacking, although if you did a small trip, uh, you could put them in or strap them on your pack, uh, so they would also be good for that. So let's take a look at how it, uh, how it breaks open and I'll demo a couple things that I think are really relevant in our selection of this. Helinox makes a lot of different types of chairs and we tried them all out but we really like this one. Although it's a bit on the larger side and it's a little heavier, I found that the comfort, particularly for me as a larger guy, just made the extra difference. Uh, and also because of that we cannot just use it as a super lightweight chair but we can use it for both camping uh, hiking and kind of just have one chair instead of having multiple chairs. So that's uh, that's why we selected this and I think it's a good choice. All right, so to open this up, uh, all you have to do is just take a zipper, unzip it, and uh, you wrap the actual chair around the legs. So you can just unwrap it. And then I find that it looks like it's uh, pretty complicated, but if you just kind of let it fall out and um, you start to pull these, these legs in, pretty quickly you're going to be able to see that uh, the, the structure of the chair. And um, this is DAC uh, aluminum. It's really a very high grade uh, pole. We use them in tents and stuff like that. So one thing we really like about this company is just the quality of it. And uh, we'll do a little close up of some of the, the connections and everything in a little bit. But that's how the chair basically looks. All right, so this is the back of the chair and you can see that the two upper uh, posts go up in here. So there's a slide in on both sides. And then at the bottom, there is uh, some handy instructions here showing you how to set up the chair. And again, there's two other slots down here where the lower chair goes into. So people tell me that the best way to do this is obviously you start at the top, put this on the top, uh, you can lay the chair on its back, and then you can pull these other lower things in, and that makes the chair then complete. So I'll demonstrate that for you now. So now we've got the chair, and we just basically take the poles, and we slide it on both sides. And you pull down like that so it's taut. And then coming over, you basically just pull. Same way on the other side. This is where you have to pull in a little bit to get that in. And there you go, you've got a complete setup on the chair. Now another nice thing about the Sunset uh, with a higher back is that you can take the, the case that's uh, for the unit, stuff in some t-shirts or a fleece or something and actually make a, a nice neck rest for it. I also found that the Sunset chair was much more comfortable than the smaller chair in that the smaller chair just kind of hit my back at the wrong spot. So when you're buying these, you probably would want to go to an REI or a sports store and actually send in the different types because it's just impossible to really tell the fit, uh, you know, over the, over the internet or trying to order it on Amazon or something. So here's the chair. It's completely put together right now. Super, super light. 
Um, it's got some rubber feet on the bottom, so it makes it very easy to put into different types of terrain. If you have it on a beach or something, they do make an accessory that goes at the bottom that actually makes a solid surface so that the legs don't uh, sink into the sand. Imagine a nice hike back into the backcountry, uh, having to sit on a, a hard rock to eat your lunch or having this chair with you and setting it up and enjoying uh, the beautiful sights and being very comfortable. So that's the real benefit behind this chair and uh, that's why we got them. And you can see I'm a pretty big guy. I'm about 6'2 and uh, well over 200 pounds. Very comfortable. I understand that the capacity of the chair is up to about 300 pounds. So, so far, highly recommend the chair. We'll probably do a follow-up review after we've used it a while. But uh, I really do recommend it. I would strongly suggest, again, that you look at the Sunset chair versus the smaller one. Uh, but if you're smaller in size, that other chair might make more sense to you. This is Jeffrey Douglas, and it's coming from Palomar Mountain, which is in San Diego County. I hope you have a great day. Thanks for stopping by, and uh, we'll see you soon.